friend Neelam and I'm here with Patrick, Shiseido's new global colour artist and he's going to give me some tips on creating a five minute makeup look. So I'm, so I'm going to take the Kajal Ink Artist, so this is in the colour Tea House in number one and I'm, I'm actually going to use this just right on your lash line so I'm going to have you close your eyes. I'm going to put this just right onto your lash line just to give give your eyes like a little bit of depth. Um, when, what's really great about this is like it's very blendable. So this is the Yanahake brush. We're going to do the same thing on, on the other side. Oh, let me turn this way for me. Putting this just right onto the lash line just to give it some depth and some some drama. Again, just taking the Yanahake brush and just smudging it out. I think it's so important to like to curl your eyelashes because it really just lifts your eye and it um, it like awakens everything. Yeah, I get the Shiseido eyelash curler. It's legendary. I feel like it's the cult product. Legendary. So this is the Imperial Lash Mascara Ink. I really like a brush that can really just get to like the root of the lash and really extend and make everything more dramatic. So I'm just gonna put this right from the base, working my way to the tip. And so you wiggle it? Yeah, I do yeah. I do like a little wiggle so it gets it gets just right on. So the next product just to finish off your skin, so this is minimalist whipped powder blush. And the reason why I love this blush is that it's so lightweight and I feel like as a model like you don't want too much makeup on, you wanna look young, you wanna look healthy, you want like you want your skin to look like like skin. Yeah, like skin. Yeah. So I am using the minimalist whipped powder blush in the color Setsuko. And I'm, I'm gonna apply this just right onto the apples of your cheeks. The reason why I love this blush is that it just it just melts into your skin. So it, again, like it looks like your cheeks are just flushed and and healthy. Now, for my favorite part, I am gonna apply a lipstick. So this is a nice like maroon. I love colors like this when I'm when I'm doing like a very like minimal eye. I want to add a lipstick that kind of like that complemented your skin tone and the makeup. What's really great about these are, are that like the bullet is is shaped so that you can actually um, not use a liner. You can just actually shape and draw on your lip without a liner. So I'm gonna go in starting from the center of the lips, working my way to the perimeter. And then I always like to overline just right in the center and then I stay along the lip line when I go out towards the perimeter. So I'm gonna apply this, this right onto your lips. So this is in the color Velvet Rope. And like, how does how does the texture feel? It feels nice. I feel like it's not drying. It feels quite nourishing. It's very like wearable, right? Yeah. I love this shade. I'm so glad you chose this shade because it's one of my favorites to wear. I really like a deep lip. And I feel like it's very pigmented. Um, so I'm gonna just finish off the face now. So this is the Oradu. So this is in the color Solar. This is our new highlight that I'm so excited about. I'm actually gonna put this first just right onto the center of your eyes, just so it gives it a little bit of a pop, just right onto the center. And just to give you like your eyes a little like glisten. And then I'm gonna blend it out with this blending brush. So you I'm really just putting it right on the center. But what I really lo I love about the, the highlighters is that it's so lightweight and it's also, it just like, it has all these like pearl particles in it. So everything looks nice and wet and sparkly and like a little bit goes a long way. You can like see so much glow. Wow, yeah. I'm just gonna put it right onto like the flattest point, but the highest point of the cheekbones. I'm gonna put a little bit just down, bridge your nose, and a little bit on like the peak of your forehead, so that you bring a little, like a little bit of that glow, that so everything looks nice and cohesive. Then I'm just gonna take this um, brush and just kind of just blend everything together. So that, again, we have no harsh lines, and just everything just looks nice and diffused. So if you if if you ever have a breakout and it, and you have a hard time covering it, what's really great about this di this Diapude brush is that it's dual ended and it has this um, this silicone tip where you can actually just use it and just like to just to press 
in the product so you're not really moving the product around and, and you're you just cover exactly what you want to cover and you can leave it oh wow yeah. that's good um but here this is the final look it's super easy it's super fresh and wow it's, it's, i love it i love the highlight everything we did was like super quick right yeah and i love how you put it on the eye as well i feel like it just gives it another dimension yeah thank you you're so welcome much.